First move. It's a steep hill right there. Ferocious gas leak. Third gear. Well, as you can see, we got it driving. We had it locked up on us, and the hydraulic pump, there's a pressure valve in there that our cousin said they're big Alice guys that can get stuck. And it was locked up on us like all summer, so this is road gear. These old WDs and 45s don't go super fast. With that valve locked up on us, and uh, you know, the engine like locked up, and we didn't know what happened to it, so we got that cousin came out, we just rocked it back and forth in road gear, and it popped. So it popped, and then I cleaned out the gas tank, washed. Rinsed it out, I should say. Hey, she died. Was that fourth? I think so. Well, rinsed out the gas tank, you know, cleaned it up some. She's not exactly a 
short rig. I'm about. Uh, yeah. Does the right side brake work better? But yeah, obviously we got some tires on it. These are 14, 9, 20. It's probably not better, but it doesn't stick. 14, 9, 26 is, I believe. We put those on last fall and then tried to start in it. It went wah, 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 wah. And died, would not start, so. Yeah. Needs a tune-up bad. That carb is in need of help. The tires are also getting low on it, but it runs and drives. It's really bad view, but This hose is full of water here, so I imagine the cylinder's junk, but, and that's for the main lift, this cylinder, this one right here. As you can see, it's full of water. And the motor's a little tired. Yeah, this motor is very tired, and it also hasn't knocked on us yet, but, you know, it'll start pretty quick. Hopefully, since that cylinder was all the way down, it's uh, not terrible in there. But this is a three-stage lift. It rolls, you got the rollers, it rolls in here, and you can see there's a gap right here, and this whole C-channel in here slides up too. So once this one rolls up, I imagine this one starts to slide up too. So. I guess I am in third gear. So. This is a three stage lift and it is 26 foot tall. 26. 13 foot tall. Yeah. Figured we'd make this little video. Clean the gas tank out, but the sediment bowl has no gasket except an O-ring. This hose is literally cracked out so bad that it will not seal. And it is overflowing at the carbs, so. Needs some fuel system work. <laughs> even though there's literally nothing to it. Yeah, even though there's nothing to it, but. Got this tank cleaned out so it's not just pure rust coming out of it, as you can see. It should be lined and all that crap, but. We're not there yet. And it probably won't be. And it probably won't be, yeah. John's right. You know, these tires have been on this tractor all winter. They're more cracked up than we thought. But if they hold air, they're good enough. These tires have been on here all winter, and it has not washed the dust off of them yet. So that's how dry we are. But Right, Jersey? But our idea with this thing is, is we've got a three-point hog carrier that we're gonna try and maybe adapt some Westendorf hooks onto this so we can just use this as a man lift yes it is sketchy but you know if we can get it running right and uh, you know pumping if this thing is to fail lifting something you're just going straight down instead of with the loader you're up there like this if the loader cylinder hose blows you're going down like this and if the cylinder on the bucket full blows you're going down like that so theoretically yes it looks like a death trap but should be safer than a ladder I feel if you fell if you fell off of this thing you're just going straight down in the basket you might get a jarred back which is still better than a better than a you know falling out of a loader like that or off a ladder so hopefully in time we can get this thing to run right but you know it locked up on us and we just didn't have time to mess with it, it. Lock up on us, it just... well that oh here's 
there's a pressure valve this is the hydraulic this thing right here hydraulic valve pump I guess it's pump and valve all in one right here and that runs off the uh, tractor PTO we don't have the PTO engaged right now because we don't want it to spin that pump with these lines and that water in the line so we haven't had the PTO on and obviously because these hoses are blown so we haven't had the PTO on so it's not been that big of a deal but there's a pressure valve in here when we were rocking it we heard something pop over here so we think that's the issue there so we might end up just taking it off or something who knows but yeah here it is a little update for you it might be a 10 minute video or something like that so I guess we'll show the sticker this is the first time this tractor's ever moved when John and I have been around dad had it beforehand but it says orange is power Alice Chalmers so yeah right Jersey runs right good thanks for watching guys oh you got a bark from Jersey <laughs> That's a rare occurrence. <laughs>